think about arts and crafts, I think about crafting. I enjoy crafting because it's a way that you can express yourself. There's no right or wrong way to craft. There's so many options from painting, decoupaging, knitting, crocheting, jewelry making. It's a whole world out there. It's something that anybody can do, whether you're beginner or advanced. You don't really have to know what you're doing. You just have to be able to follow directions. With arts and crafts, it's all personal preference. From style to design to colors, just be you. People decoupage to turn old things and repurpose them into cute, artsy things. I like to decoupage because it's something you can do and it's basically up to whoever's doing it. There's no right or wrong. You just, you can be creative and put your own spin on whatever you're doing. <laughs> I feel like people do arts and crafts so they can feel accomplished and be able to say that they made something on their own and didn't just go out and buy something off the shelves. I'm making this box for Giselle. It's going to be a memory box so she can put all of her whatnots in it from South Carolina and remember everybody when she goes back to Chicago. I like having a memory box because I can remember all the people and friends that I've met and all the things that I've done. She went shopping, she learned how to ride a bike, she made best friends, so now she can fill in all these spots on whatever she wants to with her box of memories. I think arts and crafts are important because families can do them, couples can do them, or you can do them individually. It doesn't have to be perfect. I do not agree with so much TV time, so I think that if everybody can get together as a family and do a craft or a project, it brings them together and it's a bonding experience for the family.